Welcome to another video. Walk on the wild side, and I am in Lytham. But look at this. What a sad sight. The famous Lytham windmill has lost nearly all its sails. Yeah, check this out. What a sad sight this is. We've had some pretty horrendous weather lately, and the gales last few nights have been horrendous and look at this the sails have nearly all come off altogether on the famous living windmill here on the green and I think maybe they were rotten I think that's probably why they came off so it started with one a few weeks ago which I did a live stream on and since then I think the council might have taken one off and then another one blew off in the wind and now we're left with one but it does look like they're going to have to replace all the sails all together so there it is living windmill there with only one sail and hopefully they will be repairing it soon i think it's british aerospace or bae systems just down the road at wharton i believe that they can fix it i think they're responsible actually for the the windmill but anyway i uh, just want to show you this view out here looking over the ribble estuary get some really good wildlife out here very popular for photography as well there's a boat out there called the celestial door and you can see the uh, the mast of it over there look looking towards southport over here by the way you can even see a hint of liverpool you know the big cranes that are brutal the ribble estuary I'll just show you around while I'm here. This is the old lifeboat house here on the green. And I'm on the old slipway now, the old cobbled slipway. And there's an anchor here. Look, look at this here. Yeah, so this is the old slipway here. Look, a cobbled slipway. Here's a look around the back. I can hear a lot of starlings up there screeching away. It's a working windmill all through the 19th century. It was a working windmill right up until about 1920 I think. Yeah and now it's a massive feature of Lytham but unfortunately at the moment it's lost all its sails. I'll tell you what there's some nice cars parked up along here. A couple of Porsches. I think that grey one's a Ferrari. I think there's someone camped up out here look that church is called saint john the divine it's got quite a big steeple on it anyway i'll leave the windmill behind for now and i'll just show you a little bit of the town center i'm going to head down here station road and we'll have a quick look at the town center of Lytham. okay so i'll come down station road and i'll just show you a bit of this part of Lytham here so this is the main drag, Clifton Road. I did a live stream down here not too long ago if you want to check that out. I'm taking some of this tree down here on the main road, must be some broken branches. Okay, I'm going to keep this video fairly brief because the rain is starting to come down again. I'm just over the road from Whelan's famous fish restaurant and just over the road from that is this place here taverners of Lytham proper hardware shop look at this looks like the wind has blown most of the leaves off the trees anyway I'm going to head down towards the centre where all the bars and the posh restaurants are we'll have a little look around there and then uh, we'll see what it's like shall we Okay, here's a look at Clifton Street from the other side. And I'm just opposite the Ship and Royal Pub. Look at this. There's not a grand building. And just over there is Seniors Competition for Whelan's Seniors Fish and Chips. Okay, I'm now in the centre of Lytham. This is where it all happens. There's Stringers over there very exclusive 
shop here in Lytham. That road down there takes you to Lytham Hall. So I'll just show you around. That's looking back down where I came from. So we're now in the centre, the square here. And this is where all the fancy restaurants are here in Lytham, the bars, the bistros. You've got this little seating area here with this uh, nice mosaic. This is where all the people come out to eat and drink here in Lytham. Okay, here's a look down Henry Street and we've got the Taps down there, the famous Taps pub, just down there. I'll show you around here. Yeah, these are all the very fine eating and drinking establishments here in Lytham. I believe that Owen Oyston used to come in here quite a lot when, when he was the owner of Blackpool. Not seen him for a long time, but used to see him driving a Ferrari around here sometimes. A nice old Mercedes there. Eh? Anyway, I'm going to head back to the green now. We'll have a little look on that and then we'll finish this video off. I'll just quickly show you this building here, the assembly rooms building. Just over here. Living green. Yeah, so that road is called Dickinson Terrace. I think there's swimming baths around here somewhere. I always thought that was a swimming bath, but I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm back on the green now. And you can see that we're quite a long way from the windmill now. I'm not going to appear on camera on this one. Because I look a bit bedraggled today. Anyway, I hope you liked the video. If you do, hit the like button and also hit subscribe. And tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I will see you again on the next one.